actually a seamer painting, kind of like abstract painting, the way I build up patterns and, and color and shape, form, and the, the empty space and line. So um, it's figurative, but at the same time in mind, it's kind of abstract painting still. We kind of like create our own Edens to survive in a complex world. Because well, today you get so much information and things are changing so quick. So it's a lot, a lot of stuff to deal with for people and for me too. You know, climate changes, wars, whatever. And uh, so people they kind of like uh, make this small Edens to, to survive. So um, all my paintings, you know, everybody, everything's like floating, moving. Nothing is for sure, uh, so it's kind of like uh, ironic, my painting, serious, uh, it's about serious things like uh, pollution, uh, death, life, love, um, the loss of it, but, but at the same time it's kind of like made in a kind of amusing tone. And my approach to the painting is kind of different, sometimes I, I have plans uh, how to, what I want to do with this painting. Sometimes I just flow with it. it, it it's really different. Um, actually, I like best the paintings where I, where I had this concept from the beginning. But I must say, sometimes uh, well, uh, the paint, paintings where, where it just happen while I'm doing it, quite interesting too, because they're kind of like um, making me go new areas where I wasn't to kind of expand my, my language in, in painting. Leah has now been painting in Shanghai for a couple of weeks, and for this reason I hope the paintings will contribute to the strengthening of Sino-Danish cultural relations and mutual understanding. So I would like to conclude by congratulating Leah and Art Labour with this show, and wish both partners a very successful exhibition and best of luck. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, uh, thank you very much. The show to me is, um, uh, I, I called it, when I first walked in, I, I said uh, that it's a toxic shock world. It's, uh, it's like, um, that's enough said on it, toxic shock world.